I knew I was a dead woman if I walked through my back door again. I'm Kathy, and I lost my son. Two daughters. Six months old breastfed infant. I lost custody to my abuser. Despite the fact that I was the victim, my daughters were victims. And I haven't seen her in over nine years. In the back of my mind, I'm like, what did you do to your children that they would take your children away from you? Like, this is not gonna happen to me. Women don't have a choice between something good and something bad. They have a choice between something horrible and something awful. I honestly believe that he would kill me if I left. None of us want to believe that it would be possible that a woman could be victimized in front of her children and then the batterer is the person who received custody. Do you realize that an abuser tries to alienate you from the rest of your family and he wants you just for himself? We tell mothers to get out of domestic violence. And I listened, I did get out, and I lost custody of my kids. I always say it's like the Catholic Church scandal. There were advocates for decades trying to expose that, nobody believed them. My son went from 330 days with his mom to 30 days with his mom. It makes no sense. In law, in logic, there's no sense to this. I wake up with a crushed heart every day. I think about my son. That's why I don't. <laughs> every second, I think about my son. Every second, uh, every minute, uh, every hour of the day.